Hey up everyone, and welcome back to the north for another episode of War Tales. Last time we helped tell the old Mad Fear scene, basically, I don't know, leaders I suppose, to go and deal with some of Leyhart's men, and also blow up a bridge which I'm pretty sure is, you know, vandalism? But it's war boys and girls, this shit sorta of just happens. Uh, this episode, I think we're just going to do a few contracts around Arthur's and sort of like open the map up a bit. For example, we're kind of going to slalom. I'm going to come down here, go deal with this rat infestation, then slalom back down to Korsha, then come on down here, then Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift my way up here and do an assassination mission, which we haven't done before, and then we're going to go up here and help go help find the Lost Ex Expedition, which is actually going to take us to somewhere that is actually quite a special part on the map. Uh, although I'm not guaranteeing that we're going to go and storm the area that we see when we get there. Which, people who have been there will understand. But without further ado, we're all ready. Everyone's the best that we can do. We've got quite a bit of money. I used a bit of influence to negotiate our pace. We get like a decent amount. So for example, that's now... Stop moving. Let me look at you and be the... Oh, please help. Do the... Thing! Ah, oh, fine, I'll go there. So that was 252. It originally was like 140. But I negotiated by using the influences. Since we get so much of it from being ha happy anyway, we might as well use it. Right. Let's go burn out some more rats, I suppose. Have we got some torches? We do have some torches. And we've got that new bow to try out with Raya to see if that sort of like crosses over each other. I really hope it does. Let's find out, shall we? Onwards, noble men and women. We have some rats to burn, and maybe some uh, ingredients to get, perhaps? So, I wouldn't really want to be going through this wood. My ish I would capture these guys, or try and capture them for money. But as far as I'm aware, as I said previously, I'm pretty sure there's not a jail in the county of Arthur's. So, there's not really much point, because I would have to literally run them all the way up to Tiltron. Or, technically, the other place, which has also got a jail. Oh, hello. Don't mind if I come and check this place out. Good day, everyone. Hello. Reno Village. That's a gander. Hopefully, we're not, it's not just full of just assholes. We'll see. Um, I might be about to be uh, proven right, maybe? Hello, Villazina. Do you want to explain why there's just corpses behind you? Be careful, mercenaries. A plague-ridden man is at large in the area. Look at what he has done to his own parents. Patricide and ma- I know it's patricide. Is it matricide? I don't actually know. Answers on a postcard down in the comments. I'm gathering volunteers as we speak to track him down and finish him off. If you find him before we do, don't spare him. The villagers will be most grateful for your help. Okay, and Lewis. This wretched lout tried to hide his condition, we never noticed. He could have been contaminated weeks ago. To think of all those who were put at risk. So does that mean whole village is contaminated? Let's look at you. Sarangan. She was an elderly woman. Her shoulder has been carefully carved out, but from the looks of it, she's starved to death. Okay. This man is old. Part of the flesh in his thigh has been carved out. Okay, so... It sounds more like they starved to death, not that he's, uh... Got... Interesting. Is he actually just a cannibal instead? Just a regular Johnny old cannibal? Maybe. Guess we'll find out if we find him at some point. Okay, I'm gonna quickly rest. I'm curious to see what level, like... Alalio, how close are you? You have got 70 more XP, and Jean has got about 100 more XP. Okay, I think everyone else is basically a companion. Companion? Erbic, obviously, you're quite new to being a scholar. Yeah, you're about 100 off. You're a companion. You're about 90 off. Raising an apprentice, but I'm going to be using her more often for all the fifi stuff now. Uh, Katarine's also an apprentice, but I'm probably not going to use her for any of the alchemist stuff until Helsing has got to companion. And Penal is obviously a novice, but I will start using him for any mining stuff because I'm good, mate. I'm just, I'm all right. I'm all right. Uh, I don't think there's any point making anything. The only thing I want to make at the moment, obviously, is the gurney, but I need some more leather for that. So to be fair, to be fair, it might actually be good to kill some animals, but... We'll see if we can find any of the filthy beggars. No, no, sit, sit down. Thank you. Let's get some food and let's get a move on. And this is what I mean about just getting influence, so you might as well use it. Because we've got 500 influence, and other than actually just using it for... Well, certain actions in, like, conversation, 
and negotiating our pay, there's not really any other use for it thus far, unless they plan to add it in for other interactions in the game. They might do. I really hope they do. Right, well, let's go up this way and this and that way. We're covering this entire mountain and unlocking its secrets, you could say. God knows what's actually up here, other than just rain and cold and sleet and pain. But that's kind of our jig. Is joining Auburn as oh, now I can't see shit. All right, boys, I've got this. As you all see, and I, from from upon high, I'll guide you into safety. Great Growler Grotto. Do you really want to call it a Growler Grotto? That's not really a regular thing to call it in Britain. But okay. Anyway, I'm gonna go in. I'm just gonna stop talking. Into the into the grotto. Oh, is this the guy? Um, can you just stay there for a second? I've got to just, uh, I'm just going to mine some things. Oh, he's a blacksmith. Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Sorry, I meant he was going to do the blacksmith thing, not be do the mining. Gunt is my top tier miner. I won't have it head said any other way. I thought I was going to absolutely screw that then. And I'm glad I didn't. But yes, the other guy will take up the blacksmithing duties when we get to building more stuff. Because... As much as I could do it, I get nothing from it now because we're, we're locked in until uh, Shiro Games decide to up it up throughout early access, which I'm sure they will at some point. Uh, okay, hello, Boren Gert. Don't, don't tell anyone I'm here, please. I beg you, you must keep this to yourself. The citizens of Prado are out there to kill me. They say I've been contaminated, but it's not true. You're actually just a cannibal, aren't you, mate? My parents are already dead. There's nothing left to... Ah, oh, mate. Kill the young cannibal, or warn him. I mean, I'd be kind of hypocritical to kill him when I've been talking about being a cannibal for so long. Get out of here, buddy. I must go. Thank you for letting me know. Go on. I'll be a good guy this time, but the villagers are going to be pissed at me, maybe. Good day, everyone. How's it going? Wow, did you just fall out? Oh, look, he was trying to escape. Kill him. Please, no, I'm not sick. Let me go. Don't listen to him. He ate his own parents. If we don't kill him now, he'll hurt someone else. I didn't kill anyone. My parents had already starved to death. I would have met the same end had I not. Mercenaries! De wow. Wow. That's how much you value a man's life. Ten whole crowns. I'm not a murderer. Mercenaries, you believe me, don't you? You've already spared me once. <laughs> the cannibal. By himself. Get ten crowns. Attack. Ooh! I mean, 10 crowns are sharpened. Yeah, okay. Am I about to commit a genocide in a village to save a cannibal? You bet your ass I am. What am I doing? Also, I can't see shit. Fortunately, it would have mean civilians. Even though we sort about numbers, we should, should be okay. Bonger, he can't die. So come here. You. Who, which civilians are going first? And God, it's so many of them. I don't actually know. There's a hidden one. A sneaky beaky. Okay. Malalia, come here and, and hold that. Gunt, you go in the middle. G Genie Boy, you come here. Yokin you, you come here. Actually, you go there. I would like Freya to stand here. Elsing to come here. An alt? There. Okay, I've got an idea of what the hell is going on, I think. Let's rock and roll! Rocking and rolling! Oh, well that hasn't actually happened in a while. I've actually thrown it and then just straight up missed. Alright, well, that's, that's fine, that's fine. Don't worry. Nay bother, nay bother. Let's just clear them out, shall we? One down! Can you... Nah, it's fine. Where is this other... I heard him just go for a trap, I think. But I don't actually see him. Nine. Try harder, mate. Okay. Which scumbag... I say scumbag. Which person's next? You're next. How far can you move? Not far enough, boy -er. Not far enough. Okay, cool then. In that case, hmm. 
you're a nude, you could lock him down. Oh, that's where you came from. I was like, you're injured all of a sudden. That's why. That'll do it. Okay, uh, in that case... You're going to do 8 to 12 to the target. That's fine. Yokonu, do me a favor. Go lock him down. Go lock and nude him down. I'll always say it. And he's bleeding because you crit him. Very nice. Very nice. Not close enough, buddy boy. Back off, Chuckles. Oh, I'm bleeding out. Bleeding out, are you? You're going to bleed out. Where's the... um? Is there a named person for the people who uh, rallied them, as it were? You know, the people who were talking to us, Gamma with a V. Blazinia. She can only punch. Oh, getting everyone to do your uh, dirty work and all you can do is punch people. Is that, is that it? Is that how you do things here? Asshole. Lazy. Very lazy. Let's do how we do things there. Ooh, almost straight up killed the person. Yep, that's okay. I might have to move him pretty soon. You can definitely get in range of Penal, right? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Penal, what can you do, bud? You can definitely hold them. Let's see what you can let's see what this new guy, who actually did pretty well in the last one, can do. Oh, there goes the armor. Keep sla- Oh, there we go. I quite like that. It must be said, I actually quite like that. It's not where I was expecting this video, this episode to start with by killing civilians. But hey, here we are. They asked for it. Let's be honest. Oh, that's not cool. That shit's not cool. Right, you're next. Are you going to be able to get to go get to Penalt? No. Then it's you. Who can't get anywhere, which is great. It's exactly how I want it. Uh, I don't actually know where to go then. I'm a little bit lost. Um, I suppose I could do. Well, hang on. Come here, Jim. John. Sorry. I know what I said. You have 17 damage now. They don't have less than 50% health left. But I will bait that person so they actually attack Jorn. So he actually gets a point. That should be fine. That would be a great place to throw a, uh, a Molotov. Hey! Said you couldn't get there. Oh, well, this is now on, like, Donkey Kong. I see. Right. Try not... Actually, stand there. Try not burn yourself, because this could go quite badly. Chocks away! <laughs> oh, and the game is lagging like a bad mother. Understandable. And then, if you come here and get me a point, please. Right, who's next? I am not worried about that in the slightest. Okay, I'll tell you what, Helsing, you come and help out over hither. I feel like this might be more of a pain in the ass. so... And also you can tap them on the back and make them shoot, so that'd be pretty cool. That'd be pretty cool, wouldn't it? There we go, nice little crit. Make your move, kids. Make your move. You're helping out by lining up for Alalia, absolutely fine. You're going to go for Jean, I assume. And we'll get Gunt locked in there. Nice and proper. Yeah, that's fun. Oh, you know what? Why not? Yep, fine. Good thing I've got the tools to do a bit of fixing up. A little bit worried for Alalia, but she's, she's dealt with worse, so I'm not overly scared. Well, these are all in combat, so I can't really do much with that. 
Can you aim? Oh god, holy, where the hell did you come from? Right. Let's test this. No, it, it doesn't stack. But it's a, th it's a three action instead of having to use Barrage. But because we've got Barrage on Freya, we can't like change it for a different one. So this is actually not going to work out too well. It might be better swapping that one out with Helsing. Although he's got Barrage as well. So it's just not going to work for us, unfortunately. If we had another Archer, let's say, it might be okay. But in this regard, not quite. Okay, well let's get this party started, shall we? Go on, Herbic. That's good. That's great. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I'll take it. Get me a point. Are you actually going to come and help your uh, friends, are you? Solid. Whoa! No, no, no! Don't get involved! Don't get involved! You... Dumb man. Great. Hey guys, get involved. I didn't ask for that. Please finish one. Alright, one down. Now come here and weaken them, please. Yep, fine with me. Oh, as if you can get round. I am getting slaughtered here. Do not, do not like. Right. Time for a bit of payback. How do you like me now, boy? -er? Who's next? Who's gonna go next? You are. Well, I'm going to run away slightly and bait them. I love baiting. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, oh but I am bur he is burning, which is a slight problem. You're practically dead. Let's just make sure you are dead. And now, if you could stand in front of Helsing and get deflection. I'm going to be using most of my Valor points to deal with these idiots. Burn its cause, but I'm worth to do. Two's fine. You're gonna go next, and then it's you. Hoo hoo. So why don't you give him another quick slice? And hopefully, bleeds out. Here's hoping. Ah, okay, almost. Almost. Idiots. Always fall for it, don't you? Always fall for it, don't you? Pathetic. You reach all the stars. Climb every mountain higher. No, not quite. I'll tell you what. Come here. Come here. Yeah, that'll kind of do. You hit all three of them just to do a bit more damage, especially this guy. Run back a little bit. Get me a point for throwing that. Thank you very much. Thank thee. You're almost dead. Yeah, big birds, to be fair. Let's finish that one off. And then, if you can then use that, activate Jean. Beautiful. And then we'll get that point back. There we go. I don't know if you can get close enough. Can't. That's what you get. That's just how it works. Soz. Okay, Freya. You come up here. Now, fire attack against the first three enemies. Forms one attack opportunity against the first enemy. But she did attack twice. Which would suggest she actually gets two shots. I'm going to try it again. I'm going to see 
Let me see again. Waster. Absolute waster. Moving on. Man, Helsing is just cleaning up. Cleaning up. Okay. There we go. Try walk anywhere near here and you will die. Yeah, okay. Not ideal. But she does get two shots at the first person that comes in. So it's technically a three barrage. Which would be great if we didn't already have barrage. But, oh well. Right, can you frenzy and... Okay, fine, attack instead. Do what you want, Jean. I'm not your real dad. Or am I? I can't control him, he's a madman. Look at him. He just kills everyone. Which is fine. Exactly what I want him for. And he cooks a mean meal. He'll either bake you bread or make you dead. That's his slogan. It, I don't really know if it is. Was that really necessary on a woman who's just wearing, like, a dress? I felt a bit harsh. Like, justified, but harsh. Where are you going? Oh, he got his just... He got his reward. He got revenge. Here comes revenge. Right, who's next? You are. Get behind him so you don't get twatted by Alalia. How's that, eh? That'll work. Oh, oh, I'm feeling, I feel you, buddy. But don't worry, I'll put you out of your misery as well. How's that? Bye. Okay, who's next on the chopping block? Well, let's just cover this person in Overwatches. He ain't getting out alive. Can we push this person all the way down? I don't think we can. We can basically kill them, though, so that will also work. Might as well galvanize. Why not? There we go. Penalts. 26. Well, weaken them first. Yep, that'll, that'll do it. And then slap and slap. I like that weapon. It was definitely worth fighting those guys for it. And also, we got Keteran out of it, which was pretty damn handy. Now, can you escape after you've attacked? No, that's a shame. Although, I think you're probably going to kill her. I'm going to get behind her just to do the old, uh... Oh, I can't. Oh, well, she turned around, but... Fine, I'll stab you in the front. Whatever. Bish, bash, bosh. Rancher outfit, armor plus 21. That's actually better than I thought. All right. I'm just going to take all of my tools, except one. To fix them. I got five cloth, three grease, 108 crowns, parsley, and some rancher outfits I'm just going to sell because I don't need them. Okay. Is anyone close to leveling up? Pretty close. Pretty close. Okay, Boring Gert. Thank you for saving me. You are good people. Yeah, we're okay. You know, I don't regret eating... <laughs> what? You know, I don't regret eating my parents. No. It is their death that keeps me up at night. Moving along sharply and swiftly. So, sharpen... Is that better than the one that Keteran has? It's not going to be, is it? No, is it balls as? We just kill... We just killed 14 villagers for a weapon that is worse than the one we have. So, did they die for nothing? Maybe, but they shouldn't have baited that guy. Didn't have the plague. Just could have just asked, asked, the, asked the doctor. But no, they just assumed... He was riddled, but instead he was actually a cannibal. Which is, you know, it's... Oh, hello. Good, bad, I'm not the person to judge. I mean, I am, but... Hey. Do what you gotta do to survive. This, this channel does not condone cannibalism. Let's get that, that out there. Right here. Right now. Stay away from me. You stay over there. In your allotted area. I need to go kill these bloody rats. Who, to be fair, compared to... Those villagers might actually not be an issue at all. Who are you guys? 
hold for a second. I was kind of hoping the uh, iron would have respawned, but I guess that didn't work out. You piss off. I'm not in the mood. What did I just say? What did I just say? I'm going to quickly rinse these guys because I know we've already... Wait, I can negotiate with them. No, I'm not negotiating with them. We do not negotiate with terrorists. Well, that was almost a complete waste of time. Except I did get another bow out of it, so that's something. I've got a lot of stuff to fix. Let's see what the bow does. Dexterity plus 8. What's the one that Thray has got? Dexterity plus 8. So shoot order, vicious shot. Okay, well, I think I'll go back to Vicious Shot. It's still going to do the same damage. Bray is also leveled up, so I guess it wasn't a pointless fight. Ooh, and of course, I'm going to take double to Dexterity. So she's already even better. Perfect. Okay, well, I need to repair a few things. I need to sell a few things, because these bows are just going to sit here now. And also, you know, the dagger, which I got from the cannibal, which uh, I killed 14 people for. And I'm just probably going to get about 30 crowns for. That's how much your lives are worth. Anyway, I'm going to camp up, I'm going to head back to town very quickly, because we are now pretty banged up, and then we'll head back to the rat infestation. And we will do it, I swear. Oh, bloody hell, all I wanted to do was come up here, kill some rats, do a slalom movement, go back home, start again. But no, peasants and people alike had to get in the way, didn't they? But now, here we are. Let's go kill and burn some rats, please. 317 crowns. Hey, that'll put us at 1,000. That is pretty baller. Let's go. Uh, right, where's Keteran? Where's our linchpin, as it were? There she is. Y'all can just stay back there. If I could get... Now that Freya's got that other bow, this shot could be handy there. So tell you what, Helsing, you come here. That actually should be kind of okay. Alright, you know what to do. Lob it? Oh, apparently not, don't lob it. Uh, no, that should be that should be fine there. Lob it. And let the fun begin. Rat style. Big rat style. Uh, okay. You run over here. Get a bit of an extra point. You're going to go to Yokanood, which is fine. Don't worry about that. Give me a point. Thank you. Your playground is going to go next. Now. Now, Jean, you remember your job last time. You were an extermination man. And you are going to continue to be extermination man. Especially for those goddamn prices. Right. Good start. No worries, give me a point. Thank you very much. I don't mind too much about the fever. Okay, Helsing. You could start popping off of that thing. That would be great. Okay, 15's okay, I guess. The drums are getting a bit... Someone tell the second drummer of the band to keep up with the other drummer of the band, because one of them is just now mashing it. Mashing it! She's mashing it. She does that. Yeah, it should be fine. Right, that angry rat is going to be angry. Kelsifreeze. Go help out down here. They're going to get reinforcements. Or rat, re rat reinforcements. From their mouseketeers. I guess. I couldn't think of a better name. The Ratillery? No, that doesn't really work. Scream all you want, buddy, you're dead today. I wish that activated that, but it just doesn't. That's, um, actually quite a lot of rats. I know it's surprising to say that, you know, we're in their house, but it's, it's quite a lot of rats. <laughs> Damn, I got to stand, like, right here. Right, that one's gone. Good job, everyone. And then you're going to lay down... Oh my god. Yes, right there. No, oh, not moving, are we? Okay, fair enough. You're not going to be able to kill it. It's not really going to matter. Go on, do me a solid. Basically do that, and then 
give encourage. Oh, everyone's still got it. This round, I'm gonna I'm gonna bump it again just to be safe. All right. Bonk you. Not way too fast about killing you. Also, that's also fine. Like, absolutely fine. Right, Crack Squad. As in, like, not Crack Squad, but Crack Squad. You think you can go and deal with that one up there? I think you can. I believe. Nice. How much do you do? 17 to 21. You're cooler if you did. Oh, God. Oh, look at how it, like, gl it's not glitching out, but, like, the FPS drops to 12 FPS. That's amazing. Throw it. From a solid 80 to 12. Oof. Big oof. It's cool, though. Got that one? Yeah, that's alright. Do that. Alright. Uh, also, you go up there with moi. You're gonna do me a solid to help me try and destroy this place. Oh. Fingers crossed. You're gonna be the crack squad that gets behind the broodmother and stabs it when I'm good and ready. I think we can probably handle it until then. I think. I mean, to be fair, like, oh my god. There's so many rats. There's so many rats. Just chilling? That's cool, bud. I get that. Ah, uh, there's two of these assholes here. Are they really getting poisoned? Can they be poisoned? I don't know if they can. This might take a hot minute, you know? This just might take a hot minute. Might not be worth it. I'll see. We shall see. No, no, no. Go in there. Stab it, and then apply Fury to the two of you, so you should be able to deck it. Oh, do you not get Fury? Oh, all allies. You know, I never really noticed that. That's a, that's a crying shame. Oh, well. Everyone's going to take quite a bit of poison damage. There's a reason we're going back to town after this. Too many rats, too many, many rats. You're dead. Didn't mean to do that, but it's cool. This is kind of fine. Stand in front of Helsing so he doesn't get so he doesn't get dicked. Bonk that one, please. Very good. I suppose you could bonk the big big one a tiny bit. You know, just to sort of get it going. Uh, I wouldn't get into combat with it. Maybe not. What can you do? I mean, is that it? I mean, that's it. That's not really all that much. Stand there. Just stand there and look good. John, I need you to do me a favor and help out Freya because she's currently stuck between a rat and a hard place. That'll do. Kill that one. God damn, you're a monster. A beautiful monster. Mm, it's fine to do it here. Because at least we can get out this way. There we go. Get out of there. Rats on parade, get out of here. See, here comes little drummer boy with the music again. Doesn't know what he's doing. Yeah. No idea. Right, I think we might be okay, so I'm actually gonna go and give a hand over here. Would have been kinda weird if it moved, so. Kinda good that it didn't move. You're gone! Yeah, I guess beat the rat. Not a euphemism. 
No, at the end of the day, you're just, hold, you're just holding him back. Wow. Now Ratsuk wants to get some fever. Just finish it, mate. Good work. You're only taking six damage a turn. You've only got 21 health. I'm going to have to be careful with you, buddy. I might have to end this sooner rather than later. Get in the sea. On the plus side, we can basically just kill the Broodmother whenever we want. Where do you think you're going? Oh, the thing's gone. Overwatch is gone. Barrage is gone. Oh, the rats are free! Genie boy! Did it get that far? Apparently it can. Yeah, that's fine. I should be able to get take this out next turn. Should. And then I can just wipe the broodmother. I think I think two's enough. Two's enough. Oh god, here we go. Oh hello. Good day, everyone. Right. Please please stab it. Okay. Please galvanize. And then get back out. And then, oh, can you do it? Can he? Can he do it? He can't do it. Just not quite enough. Not quite. Okay. Well, Freya could finish it next turn, and then we can eviscerate the Broodmother. Is basically the plan. Okay, Freya, Freya, finish it off, please. And then just to make sure we don't all come and get you, do that. Oh no, Jean's got on the plane! By the way, that's not a good thing. Just so everyone's aware. Guess it was only a matter of time that that was going to happen. Alright, well, time to stop pissing around. We've played long enough. Beat the rats. Beat the rats. Nice. Continue to beat the rats. Come on, buddy. Something's got to give. Just die gracefully. Can you do that? Can you die gracefully? There's a big fat rat. You fat rat. Aww. All right. Stab it in the ass a lot. Please, Keteran. Finish it off. Thank you. Your companion killed 30 rats and destroyed two plague infested growths. Yokanu became a duelist. Very good. 16% critical hit is nothing to sneeze at. So we've got two plague infected growths. we got a brain, so we can use that to buy uh, another schematic or blueprint. So that's good. We've got 97 fangs, so wow. We've actually got. Wow, we've actually got 215 fangs now, which I can use to. Oh boy. Oh, buddy. I'm so sorry, Jean. How many... So, the way that Plague Infected Wounds work is, so you can go and get the Cure, which some uh, warriors of the Plague, I guess, are walking around with, so you can just buy it. But there's also a 25% chance that Medicine will fix it. <laughs> oh no! Jean had the Plague! Anyway... Back to town! <laughs> I don't believe that worked so well. There was a 1 in 4 chance, and they nailed it. Well, ladies and gents, we did it. We have got to over 1,000 crowns. We are literally rich as ever. Can't believe it. Well, I kind of can't believe it. We've been trying really hard. So where are we going now? Now that the rats have been dealt with, and I've sold all the stuff I didn't need, we're off to go assassinate Adelaide's... Adelaide's? Adelaide's? Adelaide's troop. Is anyone close to level 5? Close. 100 off. 60 off. 19 off. I think we might see some level 5s before the end of today. Right. Avoid these guys, because I'm just not feeling it. I just want to get to the contract. If they try and chase after me, I will just cheese it. Or I could get between them. Try and between them. Haha, -ha, the old slalom, baby. Yeah, not that one, did you? 
Where are we going? Yes. So, ignore the rabble here. This is not what we're here for. We're actually here to do a tiny bit of an assassination job. Which should be interesting, because we've never done it before. But I imagine they're going to be ready all up in the nines for us. So I guess we'll see what's about to happen. Also, I imagine we're probably going to get some suspicion. But we'll see. Level 4. Adelaide of the Oathbreaker. We've got three duelists, two sappers, which I'm not a big fan of. Three legionaries. we got what? Four, seven, nine. Let's go. Also, that is not how you count, by the way. So... Unit also deals, so I need to deal with the leader. There she is. Oathbreaker. So these two are here. They're the problem. Hmm. Right. Let's get everyone decked out and ready. Because I can technically... Yeah, this is kind of a pointless field of attack, I suppose you could say. Might as well make them walk to us. Kinda. How many people can I scrunch in? It's the most scrunchiest thing I can do to scrunch. So you two are going to go first. But I guess it's fine. I need to sort of bop you in, basically. To stop you. Okay. How far can you move? Not well, oh, you can move quite far to be fair. Oh, he's got the interception thing, right? Okay, Jean, come here. You're gonna be much help. Shields and Northern, it be me, are gonna help out there. Keteran, burning them and stabbing in the back will be very helpful. I think this is how we're gonna. This is how we're gonna play. Are they too far away for me to bop, twice bop them both? Let's find out. Yeah, yeah, they are too far away. Okay, well, in that case, I imagine her ability is going to be to stab Knight. Wow, all right. All right, Johnny show off. Let's get that straight, that we're not in that business. And then we can... Okay, cool. Cool start. Could you stab her in the back? Say, for example, if I went here... And then when st stab, and then if I went stab, stab, stab. God damn right I can. That's why I think you're leader, buddy, old pal. I'm now probably gonna bait this guy to come over here, but I'll accept it. The leader's gone. They're not gonna get their ability anymore. I don't have to keep them locked down. Ah, that's how we're playing it, is it? Who's next? Sapper and Duelist. Now would be the time. How far can you run? You could run that far, but technically he can get further by doing the cheese move. Everybody do the cheese move. You can just shoot him. Well, a 10 for Elsing's a bit crap, but to be fair, the armor is pretty heavy. So, throw up a barrage overwatch there. And Urbic, you come back here in preparation. Get me a point, please. Thank you. Are you going to come in range? Oh, yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You're also going to be an idiot. You can't run through rocks, though, surely. No, evidently you can't. Vicious shot. Oh, God. Oh, I'm sorry, Helsing. I'm so sorry. Whoops. Can you lock down the sapper? I don't think you can, but please go and lock down the legionary. I'll take that. Where's the other guy? Ah. Uh... Oh, you haven't gone yet. He has. It's fine. You can't move far enough, so it doesn't matter. So, not to, not to worry. It be re. Oh, I can't go there anymore, can I? Great. Uh, that should be okay. Just go around. Ooh, go around. That's okay. And then, honestly, come over here. Twat this guy, because he's a dickhead. And then forceful interrogation. 
Beat that fever into him. Oh, just the once, is it? Okay. Try a run, are you? That's what you get for running. Ah, uh, it's always me in it. Right, Yoka nude. Go and get into combat with that sapper, so the shoot order goes away. Right? No. Cool. Evasion it is. You asked for this. No, hold, hold, hold for a second, if you'd be so kind. That Legionnaire needs to get a bit blocked off, so come and be the person who takes the damage for a bit, Sean. Thank you. Yeah, you're not going to shoot, that's fine. With me. You're going to hit Sean for a little bit and smack him back slightly, that's okay. Legionary's next. He will attack Gunt, but Gunt's got repost thanks to Yokanood, so that should be absolutely fine. And then it's Mr. Legionary over here. Which, to be fair, Helsing. Kill this prick, would you? That's what I'm talking about. And then I would like you to run over here and set up a barrage. A thank you. And then... If you could do me a solid, impale this guy. Elson. Thank you. And his armor should be done by next turn. I don't know if you're going to be able to throw that from there. Not close enough. It's fine. Not to worry. Not to worry. And there goes the riposte. Riposte. Then it is your turn. Well, Freya, you might as well fire him back a bit further. Because he might not be able to reach us this way. And then if you want to come back here as well, just for safety, just for safety. This guy is getting dicked on. Now. Now. It's okay, I guess. You might as well weaken them just in case. Can you stab this person in the spinal cord to stop him from running? Take out his nervous system. What else has he got? Eh? I guess. Oh, he got out. You sneaky little bastard. Alright, he's dead next turn, aren't you? Please clobber him to death. Just like that. Hey, I asked for it, and that's exactly what I got. Eh, it's fine. Slow, slow down's whatever, honestly. Right, you attack. Absolutely fine. You stab without moving, please. And then galvanize to get one. And don't move so you don't get shot. You don't have a land, move as much as you want. This is what I mean about their movement range. It can be a bit janky about it. Not super worried about that. What we can do is do this. You! Out of the gene pool! And then do this. And then do this. Almost kill him. Helsing, would you be so kind to finish it off? Oh! I still we're playing the game. Sixes and sevens, whatever, mate. Try something harder. Aye. Hmm. You're gonna go next. I just wanna make sure this guy dies. So let's just make sure this guy dies, eh? Thank you! Come on over! Lock this person down so they're gonna get shot when they move. I'll leave that to them. Keteran, if. Oh, you can't. Oh, you've got slow down. Dodoy. Dodoy. Why not? I don't know if you're. You've already been, to be fair. So, not a problem. 
I'm just moving baby steps within this uh, shot range so I just don't get shot. It's kind of working out. It's kind of working out. Yeah, okay, cool. Please go beat him into submission. You might be able to do it, you know. Ooh, he's on 10. It's all going to depend. There it is, folks. There it is. Like, run over here, but I'm not expecting anything. Are you going to go? Well, I was going to kind of stay out of attacking him. But, no, that's an angle, so it doesn't count. If I could stay, like, slightly away, just so I'm doing damage, but they're still going to have to move, that'll do. Oh no, I'm so scared of that slight movement of your shoot order. Whatever will I do? Oh, this. And then... Oh, hmm. That makes me sad. Alright, Gun, you've got the most armor. Go and take a shot for me, will you? Thanks for doing that solid. And you can get to reap the rewards! Yeah, she had that coming. I mean, I don't know if these people do have it coming. Like, we're assassinating people. Are we the baddies? Legitimately, are we the bad guys? Because I really don't know at this point. Ah, oh, screw it. John, go on. Get your fill. Oh my god, one health. Well, you know what that means. Frenzy! Shim is not like execution screens for two-handed people. But, hey, whatever. Do I see a level up for a level five up there? I think I might do. Right, let me get some... Do I do? Uh, Alalia, 4 out of 4, she is knackered, gun. Ooh, I've only got 2 left. Well, that works for me. We only need 10, that's fine. And, Helsing got level 5. Oh. Well, could put his willpower up. I mean, 1 movement, 12 movement's already pretty damn good, let's be honest here. And 1% extra critical hit. I mean, 1 in 5 is 1 in 5. Making it from 21 to 22 doesn't make it. It only makes it slightly more of a 1 in 5. So I guess I'll go for double willpower. Just to increase critical hit. Oh! Oh, and this, in that case, this affects critical hit anyway. So, yeah. Done. And I will be going for precision. Because with precision, every two attacks, the person gets vulnerability, so you'll get a critical hit regardless of where who it comes from and where it comes from. I think precision is an absolute banging choice. Okay. Everyone's a little bit... Oh, we've also locked reputable mercenaries. Crowns gained are plus 10%. Perfect. Very good. We definitely need to camp, which I will do. Which I will do. There we go. Are we good? I think we're good. We've got two days worth of food. I am going to quickly grab some more food. And then we'll sally forth to go find this lost exposition. Because there are a bunch of dumbos getting lost, aren't they? Yes, they are, everyone. Yes, they are. I don't know why I'm being so conservative with me buying stuff now. I have so much... Wait. Wait a second. Hang on. Hello. I assassinated all those people you want. It didn't actually give me suspicion either. I sort of expected it too. Did it give us jump on this tree, I wonder? That was one crown steel. Assassination mission is completed. And 10 to my PP. So, oh wee wee. Okay, cool. Very good. I'm not going to take anything right now because we've got a literal dead ton of money. Um, well, I suppose I can take this because probably, I'd probably be taking out the old customs port anyway. So I will accept this and I'll use some negotiation. Might as well just use 20 to get to 100. Can I make it to 346? Hell yes, I can. Now, if you fail, it goes all the way back to the original bargaining price, so I'm going to keep it at 346. So it's on the way up. I'm not going to attack it this episode, but we might attack it on the way back after we go find the exposition next episode. So let's go find this exposition and show off an area um, that's been quite like, receive quite well in the War Tales community, at least when I'm, like, scrolling through the subreddit of War Tales, which I am actually part of. I do uh, randomly appear there every now and then. 
Although my name is under a very different name. <laughs> I suppose. Right, anyway. These are the people, the guys are the rats and the swords. Those are the guys you can buy the, uh, the plague stuff from. So they're the people you want to look out for. Ah, ghost wolves, eh? I'm not quite ready to fight ghost wolves and ghost pigs. I do want to show them off in the nightmares at some point. Because we do need to get need to get white leather. But right now, I just want to get up to this lost exposition. And also, it's a bit janky to get up there. So I kind of want to show like the route on how to get up there. Because it is a little bit weird. You'll see what I mean in a second. So that's the trading port that we need to go and deal with. But I'll just discover it this episode. I'll just discover it this episode. Come on. Thank you. And then I'll deal with it next time on the way back. These guys will come into play in a bit, but we're not going to deal with them right now. So, it's a little bit further up, but it's a bit weird on how to get up there. Because there's not really a path. You've just got to basically force your way up a mountain. So I've just got to basically, I'm just going to click like crazy until it lets me up. Go, 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 go. Oh, that's a lot easier than it used to be. No. Piss off. Anyway, that's a lot easier than it used to be. When I first came up here on my playthrough, I uh, I had to, like, go a bit mental with the mouse. But that wasn't too hard. So they might have actually fixed, like, the mapping of where you can walk up there. I'm just going to walk a bit further to get away from those guys. And then we'll camp right next to the concealed camp, apparently. Right, we've now camped. I'm going to quickly check the concealed camp. Although I don't think there's anything there right now. Hello, Inquisitor Octavia. Where's your carriage? Are you here by chance? You should take your leave and be quick about it. All right, I'll take my leave. Fine. Didn't want to be friends anyway. And here is the Ruin of Arthur's, which we will eventually be going into. And it has got some spooky shit. If you could plan to go in there, bring a lot of torches. Where are these guys? Pretty sure it's these guys. Like, I'm certain it's these guys. Hello, fellow citizens! Are you lost? Exploring ruins is supposed to be child's play, but we got lost before we even got there. We've been waiting to be rescued for days. The ruin is right there. We are exhausted, we don't have enough food to turn back, nor any pitons to make it home the short way. We beg you, please don't leave. Without you, we're all dead. Ha, <laughs> leave. So, I get three torches if I give a piton, and I also get... How many pitons do I have? Oh, four. Oh, yeah, cool, here you go. Ah, uh, the pit's on. Oh, blessed be the eye. We are totally grateful. Take this. It's always useful in the ruins. Yeah, it is. How many torches do we have? It's weird that it doesn't stack. It stacks four there, but I can't stack another one on top of it. I think that's a bit of a glitch, but it's fine. Or a bug. Sorry, not a glitch. Anyway, these are the ruins. We'll be visiting them soon. It's a very good tourist attraction. But for the time being, as I said before, that's probably where I'm going to leave it for today. I'm going to quickly camp. On the way back, hopefully we're going to fight some regular animals so I can get some leather so I can build a gurney, because I do want to. I could literally just buy the leather, but there's nowhere to buy it, which is really annoying at the moment. Uh, but we will build the gurney next episode. We'll deal with the old custom port on the way back, and we'll start doing more of the scenario for the fate of Arthur's. But as always, if you enjoyed this video, feel free to check out the rest of the channel. I'm sure there's some more videos on there, which will wet your whistle in whilst you're waiting for this next episode. Feel free to check out the new Battle Brothers series, or the old Battle Brothers series, they're sort of similar to War Tales. And as always, feel free to subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you know when this is coming out next. But other than, other than that, it is ciao for now.